Oh, Seth. <laughs> Happy New Year. Yep. How we doing? Good. All right. As you can see, we have a brand new body from Five Star for Coco going on the late model, but we have something cooler for you today. And uh, I'm going to tell you about that right now. What is going on, YouTube? Landon Huffman here back with another video. Happy New Year's. Happy 2024. And uh, all that other nonsense that goes along with that. I hope you had a Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays. All that good stuff. But uh, welcome back to another video. Today, me and Seth are heading to pick up another race car for Huffman Racing. This is not going to be our car store car. Uh, this is going to be a personal car for Huffman Racing, but we are adding to the stable today. So we're going to go pick that up. It is a brand new PRW car that raced six times last year in 2023. So by far the newest thing we've ever had in our possession at Huffman Racing. And uh, I'm pretty excited for that. So we're unloading this brand new body for Coco, which is our car store car. And then we're going to make the trip down to Concord to Carroll Speed Shop to pick up our new late model stock car for Huffman Racing. So thank you guys for clicking on today's video. I'm going to take you with us. It's been a minute and uh, appreciate all the support. Quick update on Coco. That's where it sits. Got all our body parts in here. I think you guys seen it last time, but we got the rear end under it and all that good stuff. About to start hanging a body. Um, I'll show you the new car, obviously, when we get it back here, too, and unload it, talk a little bit about it. But uh, now we got to head to Concord. So I think Seth's already in the van. Also, I wanted to show you guys this building that Grandpa finished. So this was the outside building that uh, he decided he was going to put up on the new concrete pad. So we got a door in here, nice door. Probably should have made it a front office, but instead, this is where our uh, tire changer is going to go. So all of our extra tires and stuff like that will go in here, but... Grandpa did a hell of a job on it, so uh, excited to have this. Got power to it and air and all that good stuff now, too. That's the Who's Your Daddy office right there. Hell yeah. Also, check out this hat. Who's Your Daddy, the Tire King. It's nice, isn't it? It's pretty cool. I like it. You should sell those. Well, my wife had this made from somebody on Etsy. For my oh. birthday so oh seth's 30 everybody I'm 30 <laughs> 30 years old hit retirement age yeah 30 years old i think i'm gonna retire when i hit 30. all right let's go get a fe feature winner future feature winner about got caught on my words there what i already know what we're naming this car we'll tell them later Well, we've made it to the Carroll Speed Shop with only a minor hiccup. Let's see. Yeah, we're, we're an hour later than we should be. Only like 35 minutes. All right, we've made it to Carroll Speed Shop, and here is our new chariot. What do you think, Seth? It's very pretty. Very pretty. It's a 2023 PRW. So we get to take this thing back today and... Uh, it's a hell of a lot nicer than what I've been racing. There's the man right there who tore up about 12 different race cars at Martinsville. Hey, you almost made the show. You're only about 20 laps from making it. 15. <laughs> We're back at the uh, community offering here. If you guys have watched my channel for a while, <laughs> you'll know that we've come to Carroll Speed Shop and got a number of body parts out of the community offering but today i think i'm feeling generous and i'm gonna leave these for the garbage guy except for this fender <laughs> oh not that fender this one over here <laughs> normally i've left here with about a whole entire body but today this is all we're taking Seth, we've gained another race car. I have another new race car. It already has a name. Black Widow. Do you like it? Yeah. Can it be renamed? I don't know. That's a good question. I mean, can it, race had, I don't know how many names. So I guess it Fido's can. Fido's renamed. We don't know well, nothing about Well, BW, Fido. maybe we just call it BBW. 
Yeah. 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 There we go. Yeah. All right. Let's go home. So this car that we just picked up is uh, the car that Connor Zillich ran a few times in the car store last year for Justin. And it's got about six races on it is all. And then uh, I think Rev Racing used it for their combine this year too, but it's a brand new PRW and by far the newest thing that I've ever had. It's very similar to uh, Deuce that's in our shop, except Deuce was built in 2018 and this is a 2023. Well, she stayed strapped. That's a good thing. Hello, Gut. Howdy. What the hell are you doing? Getting ready to take motor and transmission out. All right. Hey, Rich. What's oh. oh, I remember this thing when I was a kid. Put oh, a damn pumpkin head. Look, somebody burned it though. Probably you. you probably what is that? Templates? This is templates from dash car. A post, real screen, dash car. Quarter window or something. Window, yeah. It's going in the trash. Where was this thing from, Dad? He's cleaning off the fab table. She's beautiful. Way to go, gut. You're about to set the damn place on fire. Okay. Bye, Seth. Thanks bye. for... Uh, bye, bye. We thanks. take we take two-hour trip, take six hours. Thanks for coming. Oh, yeah. All right, I'll see you about three weeks later. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. We're going to record the podcast tomorrow or Saturday? Uh, RJ never responded to it. Shocker. We'll see. RJ didn't respond? I've never heard of that. Got a bunch of mess here because this metal table is now clean. When's the last time you think it's clean? Don't show this to my wife. Oh, that you're cleaning? Yeah. <laughs> Don't show it to mine either. <laughs> Looks good, Richard. Nice little behind. fab table there, huh? I'll be on the honey do for the rest of the race season. <laughs> Here, Gut. We got you a, uh, a present. Hey, all right. All right. Did you get me some uh, Colorado weed to go with it? Yeah. And so, or THC, at least some, gummies. some THC gummies. Heck yeah. Yeah, that's what I need now. And a brownie. Hell yeah. <laughs> I like it. Thank you. Where would you like for me to put it while you were um, taking the movie? my jacket is, if you want to stick them in the pocket of my jacket there on that jacket. This side of the shop was very nasty. So, uh, working on trying to mop some of the mud and dust and shit up. I believe that's fresh paint underneath of that. So on this car we just got today, if you look right there, it'll tell you the number from PRW, which is 191, and it was built January of 2023. So it's basically a year old, exactly. It only has six races on it. So uh, same exact chassis manufacturer as Deuce, but it was built in 2018. And uh, here, we'll go look at what number it is, actually, to give you an idea of how many cars they've built since 2018. So that was 191, and this car is 148. So they haven't built all that many uh, since then. So while we were cleaning this out, we found an old Craftsman truck windshield, which we put together was from one of my dad's trucks in 2004 that he crashed at Atlanta. Atlanta, March 2004. And he was running fourth and crashed like hell through the tribal with like 10 to go with Steve Park. And then they took the truck here and left it here. And there's the windshield from it. So. Treasure hunting. Yep. Equipment racing. Once yep. again. You never know what you'll find. We did clean out some space over there. And we have a fab table and we moved that uh, brake over there. So that's nice. But I have a bunch of junk I have to throw away. And we have a full house in here. Which is... Kind of crazy. Rich, how do you feel about renaming a car after it already had a name? New home, new name. It was previously Black Widow from Carol Speed Shop, but I think we should call her Jasmine. I think Jasmine sounds better. Black Widow sounds cursed, and we've had enough curse this past year. We've had some, some good stuff happen to us. We've had some good stuff happen to us. But we have been a little cursed. We were like 
We had a monkey on our back or something the first half of the year. Yeah, it was terrible. I agree. We tore everything up like every week. Well, Y'all let me know in the comments if it should be Black Widow or Jasmine. It looks like a Jasmine to me. Or Raven. Or, Batman. or Raven. Or Batman. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we just closed up. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know it's been kind of few and far between on the videos here during the off season, but it's about to pick up, putting a lot of effort into these race cars and starting to shape up to be a uh, really big year for us at Huffman Racing and Jimmy Mooring Racing in the Cars Tour. So really thankful and uh, just excited, man. It's been a crazy 2023 and to have all these race cars in a shop like this with uh with all the improvements and the shop to be where it's at right now compared to where we start is kind of a miracle so uh thank you guys so much for supporting the channel and uh what we do here at Huffman racing and on this youtube channel and uh looking forward to a kick-ass 2024 so thank you guys for watching i'll catch you in the next video i'm out peace